more ugly news about gas prices tonight. They are up again. We have cracked the $4 mark, putting Connecticut near the highest cost of gas in America. Tonight, AAA says the average price per gallon in our state top $4 today, hitting $4.01 per gallon. This is awful. This is well above the national average of $3.83. News 8's Aaron Logan has the latest. Exactly one year ago, the average price of gas in Connecticut was $3.75 a gallon. Today, over $4. So these prices we saw today were actually on the cheaper end. $3.95 for self-serve, $4.05 for full serve, and $3.99 if you pay cash, $4.09 with credit. These prices discussed Sydney Branch. I own a four-cylinder car, and I was supposed to save on gas, and I still got to put... $30, $40 in gas almost every week. It's just crazy how the prices is going up. I mean, I guess it sucks. <laughs> Holly Bernstein didn't even realize she stopped at a gas station where prices were $4.19 with a credit card and $4.09 with cash. You have to put gas in your car. You have to go to and from work. So it just kind of is an expense. So you just have to pay whatever they ask you to pay. State Senator Len Suzio of Meriden wants to put a cap on what's known as the hidden gas tax. Connecticut residents pay a 25 cents a gallon gas tax in addition to the gross receipts tax. This hidden tax keeps growing because it's a percentage, 7% of the wholesale price of gas. Drivers say something needs to change quickly. Not much you can really do. I shop at Stop and Shop so I can get their silly gas rewards points. And that's the best way I can fight back. I'll be on the bike and I use the fee God gave me because gas is too high. I say two and change. Back down to what, 275? That'd be reasonable again. Help or no help from lawmakers, drivers worry that prices will increase dramatically over the next few months. But they're hopeful that they won't go to 439 a gallon like they did in July of 2008. Reporting on the scene, Aaron Logan, News 8.